I'm not aware of the nature of the objection as yet. Uh, as you said, that um, indication should be coming to us this week. So yes, uh, it will merit consideration by the board, considering that it, it's coming from a high um, um, profile entity, which is the Ministry of Health and Wellness. So yes, we will um, wait for that information in writing, and then that will be tabled to the board for their consideration. If a meeting is required, and of course that is how we normally would facilitate as may be necessary. Normally, once the application come in, the investment services internal to SSB will look at the business proposal, will look at the, and the collateral that is being put up. Uh, they review the financials and in-house projections. They look at the, the loan agreements that may be in play, bank statements, articles of association, and like all the required documentation is reviewed for completeness. And then it goes to the investment committee. They also confirm that these things are, are available and they also look at repayability and the ability um, based on the assessment that was done internally at the risk of the loan. And then based on that um, scoring, they determine at what rate uh, they would consider the loan and that type of thing, no? So um, that is what takes place at the um, investment committee. So if any information is missing, it may not um, pass the first round. It has to go back and, you know, they look at it and then there's a back and forth. Um, of course, not all uh, loans are unanimous, and I must tell you that this loan was not a unanimous decision. There was uh, back and forth in terms of the different um, scenarios contemplated, but at the end of the day, it was a majority recommendation that went up to the board.